we are going to use the guess and check method to try to, to determine the square root of the number 729. So essentially this is basically just a bunch of estimating and then checking and narrowing down until we find the correct answer. So we know that 20 squared is 400. So 20 times 20 is 400. And we know that 30 squared equals 900. 30 times 30 is 900. Our number is going to fall somewhere in between 400 and 900. So therefore, the number we're looking at is somewhere between 20 and 30. So the square root of 729 is going to fall somewhere in the middle of 20 and 30. So I'm going to choose the number in the middle 25 and see if that is the correct answer. So I have 25 times 25 and after a quick calculation my answer is 625. That is not what we're looking for but we know that it's going to be now between 25 and 30. So I'm going to try 26 now. So 26 times 26 and after a quick calculation we know it's not 26 because 676 is not 729. So it's continually moving closer to 30. I'm going to try 27 now. 27 times 27. And we have an answer of 729. That is what we initially were looking for. So I know that the square root of 729 is 27.